It is 938 on daybreak and we're celebrating Western New York this morning with an annual fall favorite in Clarence. Only two weekends left for the Great Pumpkin Farms annual fall festival and this weekend highlights a returning favorite for high school technology teams along with a few other special new attractions. It's all new though to Joshua Robinson who joins us now from Clarence for his first fall festival at the Great Pumpkin Farm. Hey Josh, good morning. Hey, good morning, Melissa. You know, I try to think about what to do with pumpkins a lot when we get into the fall. I love cooking with pumpkin, but I was just saying, I've never tried to figure out how to get it to fly the farthest. And for the 12th year in a row, this is Trebuchet weekend here in Clarence. I'm actually joined by Kelly Schultz, who's gonna tell us a little bit about how this weekend is kind of developed, what some of the rules are that these technology students are looking forward to. This is a lot of fun. Later today, some of them are gonna be out here practicing. Uh, tomorrow's the actual competition. We've got 15 schools involved this year, and they will come out, and some of the things are accuracy. They try and see how accurate they can throw these pumpkins, and then other things are for distance. They go for who can throw the farthest and it's a lot of fun watching them out here setting it up because they have built all of these and uh, you know in their classes and everything else and they're very proud of what they do and it's a lot of fun to get out here. And it's all like counterbalances right there's no gunpowder or anything like that right? Absolutely counterbalances in fact you'll see a lot of those if you work out in the gym you'll see a lot of 45 pounders that they start shoving on here and everything else and just to get this thing to go and uh, it's fun and each year somebody comes up with a little bit more complicated one which makes it go a little bit farther hopefully and uh, hopefully that's the year this year. And right now you can see about how far that some of those uh, pumpkins are going to be launching. You, you were saying that there was a world record here a little while ago? Well, uh, we had we had the world record holder here with his trebuchet, and he came out two years ago, and I believe he was throwing pumpkins about 2,500 feet. And it was quite the thing to see this guy do it. I can't imagine that. And uh, Melissa, I'm sorry, but there's no way I'm going to be able to gather up a bunch of scraps of pumpkin to bring back to the station to get a huge Channel 2 pumpkin pie going. It's just it's not going to happen this oh, morning. Maybe a little bit later on. Maybe tomorrow. Tomorrow. I'll That's see if I can I then. For. Yeah, well, you can buy them there. There's lots of great, delicious bakeries that you can buy. So we'll be expecting right. some back at the station, Joshua. <laughs> Thank you.